Tibetan Buddhists are known to make elaborate sand sculptures only to sweep them away in an ode to impermanence. This guy you're about to meet now makes art in that same spirit, I guess, except it involves lattes. Here's my Nightline co-anchor, Juju Chang. It's a frothy, creamy concoction whipped up and carved out of milky foam in a matter of minutes. But this Derek Jeter will dissolve away nearly as fast. In what way is this art? I think it's art a lot of ways because it doesn't really have a use. The only real purpose of art is to be to like make someone happy. Some artists use paint, others sculpt with metal. This one, a cafe latte and a humble toothpick. I had a lot of time on my hands and I had, you know, a lot of coffee around me and I just sort of wanted to make art with whatever was around me and to entertain myself. Michael Breach is a master barista artist. From Quentin Tarantino to Natalie Portafilter to Leonardo DiCappuccino. His caffeinated creations have hooked tens of thousands of followers on Instagram. Katniss Everdeen, Oscar, Foam Alone. His creative flair has paid off in a full-time job as a jet-setting latte artist. Look at that, I made it oh, smaller. There you <laughs> See, yeah, there's Look at how much better that you are than I am. Does it ever occur to you, like, here I am, traveling the world, doing foam art? Yeah, I, I wake up every day and I go, is this a joke? Is this real? Am I actually doing this? I'll wake up in Australia and be like, wow, I'm in Australia. Doing foam art. Doing foam art. It's performance art for hip corporate brands, including chic designers. I've done stuff, uh, Kenneth Cole, I did a party for him. One day I'm at home and then I look online and I'm all over the, the newspapers in England. In the headlines, like Victoria Beckham buys frothy portrait from <laughs> New York artists, like That's the hysterical. front page. So how does one go from being a barista to the Michelangelo of milk? I just sort of did it because I thought it was funny. And somebody, I got really good at doing latte art and someone was like, oh, I bet you can't draw a face. So you start, your career was launched on a dare. I just tried to take it to another level because why stop there? Despite his rapid success, Breach still remains grounded. And just like the foam, keeps it light. The art to me looks very serious, but you don't take it that seriously. I actually do love my job because it doesn't even feel like work. I don't, I haven't worked a day in over a year and a half. For Nightline, I'm Juju Chang in a cup of coffee awesome. in Brooklyn.